All right, what's good YouTube? It's your boy, the one with Scarface, your boy Scarface. And today I'm gonna show you guys how to do, I mean, people always ask me about flash photography, uh, studio photography. And so what today, what I'm gonna do is just use a one light setup. A model here diamond so I'm gonna show you how to use one light because a lot of people can't afford to have multiple lights and since uh, I mean I can use like four or five light setup but I know a lot of people can't afford that like that many lights and they usually just have the one strobe or you could even use a speed light so, uh, so so the first thing that I do when I'm doing like studio photography is I dial in my settings so first uh, I'll keep it like normal because this one does have high speed sync so like I can, my shutter speed can go super high, which is cool, but you know, not all strobes have the high speed sync available. So we'll keep it at uh, one over 250. And I'm probably gonna do uh, F 5.6, just because I do want his face in focus, but I want it to soften out a little bit. And so I'll try to keep my ISO at 100. So that's what I have the settings at right now. I have my uh, strobe set up. So I'm gonna take a test photo to see what I'm looking at real quick. All right, and that photo, really nice. Like, I could just use that right there. Uh, so now, I've done this quite a bit, but you gotta play with the settings, like depending on what style you're, you're going for, cause not everything is gonna work. Like this one actually came out re looking really dope. Uh, it was, it's because I've done it for quite a bit, and I'll even show Diamond. Like, what do you think, Diamond? Uh, <laughs> Uh, so now I'm just gonna, since I have my, my lighting set up how I wanna do it, this is just with one light. Uh, usually you can do different lights. I would add like a hair light. Uh, I could even add like a poster board. So that's something you can add because I know some people, I mean, there's the V-flats. Have you guys heard of the V-flats? There's those, but these work just, just as good as the V-flats. Uh, I do have like this one uh, mount that I can mount it and bounce some light back in. But first we're actually just gonna we're gonna do some poses just with uh, this right here. So now it just comes to, to directing him like how you want him to pose, the different poses. So, all right, so so what I'm gonna have you do is like, I'm gonna have you turn just like that. I'm gonna have you put that foot down just like that. And what you're gonna do is like the left hand, let me have you put that in your pocket just like that. All right, let me see what that looks like right there. So this one is gonna be more of a full body. Ready, one, two, and three. So I'm liking that. So I'm gonna have you, your chin slightly turned that way. There you go, look at me. So I'm really liking that, like where you get a little bit of light on the side, uh, not too much and it creates those shadows. He's already, if you get a heavier set person, it's good to do just one lighting just because it does shape the light, their, their face, and they'll look a lot slimmer. Diamond's already super skinny, so like it just enhances all his like his jawline, all the, all these uh, different like features on his face. So it makes him look like it just brings it out a lot more. So it, they're really cool. So I'm gonna do actually a little bit closer. So let me see. Let me have you turn your shoulders just a little bit to the opposite way. There you go, just like that. Turn your face a little bit that way. Look at me. Ready? One, two, and three. One, two, and three. And one, two, and three. Like, I'm really liking how these are turning out. Watch. Let me show Diamond real quick. Oh, yeah. I look at mine. And so, th like I said, this is just with one light. I do have a, I don't remember the size of this Octobox uh, or the Softbox. It, I know it's a bigger one, but I do have the grids on it. I have the grids just because I do like, uh, I want the light to be directed straight to him instead of like spilling all over the place. Like if I didn't have the grids on it, it probably would have lit the, the back all weird. It would have been a little bit brighter, not as dramatic. So with this, it's a, a lot like, it gives a little bit more dra like dramatic poses to it. So now what we're, we're gonna do, like now you can play, you can have fun. Uh, this is why I wanted Diamond to come in so we can like do some different poses, some more like dramatic ones. So. Uh, and then you just play with them. You always want them to do something with their hands because a lot of people don't have their models do anything. Like if you just stand like this, this is just like boring. So right now let's do the hand in the pocket again with that one. And then with uh, the one where you have your accessories, since he did wear some accessories, I want him like, we want to show those off a little bit. So act like you're like holding onto your chain just like that. I want you to look that way. There you go, just like that. Ready, one, two, and three. Ready, one, two, and three. Look over towards me. There you go. 
Ready, one, two, and three. All right, with that hand that you have the accessories, kind of like, just like, if you're playing with your goatee a little bit, cause I'm gonna get a little bit closer. Yeah. Ready, one, two, and three. All right, so the same thing. Like what I want you to do, I want you to go like that. Be looking towards me. This hand, let's, let's put it in your pocket. There you go, just like that. Ooh. Ready, one, two, and three. So it, it's just like different things, like uh, making them do different things, bringing them out of the comfort zone. This is why I like uh, studio because there's not people around. So like he, he's more likely to do like cooler poses and things like that. Cause sometimes when you go out and shoot, people don't really want to pose. They just feel kind of embarrassed because the camera's out there. So, uh, so doing stuff like this is pretty dope. So well, let me try to get this angled right. Yeah, just like that, ready? One, two, and three. And so I, I usually, this is personal preference, I usually like to take like two, three photos, even if it's the same pose, just because you might run into, you don't wanna risk it, him having his eyes closed or like halfway open and things like that. If you do three, you're more than likely gonna get one with his eyes open. So uh, so now what I wanna do is, he, he brought a flannel, let's, let's go ahead and, uh, don't put it on, but just like bring it with you. All right, so with this flannel, just like that, I'll, I want you, we'll do a few, like just lean it up against your on, your, on your thigh. Leave that hand there, that one, yeah, there you go. Let's try that right there. Ready, one, two, and three. Keep your scoop forward on the seat. Right there, just like that. That, and now I want you to like, kind of like flare it out just a tad, and like uh, you're gonna be just how you are, and just kind of like look over at me. There you go, just like that. So look over towards me. All right, ready? One, two, and three. One, two, and three. And I'm gonna get a little closer. Ready? One, two, and three. Now these, like, uh, I'll put some on the screen. Adding more lights, I mean, this is perfect, but if around his shirt, I would like to add like a hair light or something like that. Uh, you can add like a, a, a board to fill like bounce light back in But or you can just do this like like I said if this is all you have to work with then you know Just use it one two and three Let me have you put one foot down. Yeah, there you go Ready one two and three So let's hold that I'm gonna come a little closer Ready one two and three so as you can see, uh, you can play with it. You're obviously gonna have to change your settings if you're looking to do something a little bit different. Uh, I like the what we're getting out of here. You know, you're getting, uh, it's showing, you know, getting that dramatic with the shadows on that side. And he's really, uh, I'm glad he wore this. This is more fall colors, more winter stuff. So now, uh, I mean, we're gonna do more more photos or like more uh, more shots, you know, but I'm not gonna record those because we, we have some like, uh, pins I want to take pictures of like uh, we got his like fashion poses and stuff too uh, so If you want to learn more follow my Instagram. I'll also tag diamond that way you guys can follow diamond like You single? Yeah, he's single. He's ready to mingle. So you saw him on the photos ladies. Come on like so uh, Give me a follow there and yeah, I'll see you guys later. Let me know for, let me know what you guys want to see All right, I'll see you guys later. Say, say bye diamond but I'm mansion in LA, right next to Mariah. Right the sun get filthy pay, price going high, yeah.